In the first season of One Hour Limit Locked, we set ourselves the challenge to get a fire cape in 45 days while only being able to play for one hour a day. I went 36 minutes overtime on the last day, but we got our cape in the end. The thing is, that was only the warm up. Now, we're really about to start cooking. 60 days are on the clock, 175 quest points are on the menu, 8 council members are in need of a charming knight in shining armour, and I'm the idiot they're getting. Welcome to season 2 of One Hour Limit Locked, it's chef in season baby. Hello again everyone and welcome back to another episode of One Hour Limit Locked, episode 30 here today. Yesterday was a bit of a weird one of all the audio shenanigans I had going on, I'm sorry about that, I have I have triple checked today to make sure all my audio is set up correctly. So I think we should be all good, it looks like it's picking up fine, hopefully. No more mishaps with that. We are almost done with our agility, we need 4,000 more experience and I was considering what we might be doing after setting free the Monkey King and the conclusion I came to is we're probably going to be doing Underground Pass next so I figured why not just do Underground Pass first and we get 3,000 agility XP from that we might get a little bit for obstacles that we pass along the way as well We'll be very close by the end of it to finishing off that 48th level and getting on to the Monkey King. So that is the plan. I am going to go and start Underground Pass. Still scurryless at the minute. I did not log in to the account to, to rebuy Scurry at all. So he is going to be chilling with Prebita for the moment. But that's probably better for him to be honest. She'll take good care of him compared to me. Alright, so I'm just going to go to the bank and get the stuff for Underground Pass. I think we have it all, so... I do need 750 coins. Oh, is that for, like, food? I think it is. Do I have any summer pies? I don't, so I'm going to need to go to the GE. Okay, I think we've got just about everything we need together. Just take an extra rope in case of failure. Got telegrab. I think we are all good. May as well just take some extra normal food as well. Okay, back over to Ardy. This will actually be an interesting quest to get a timer on to see how long it takes us to do. Because it's it's a much maligned quest. Like nobody likes this quest. It's famous for how much of a pain it is. Underground pass on one hour limit locked. I'm hoping we can get it done with enough time to free the Monkey King after. We still need a little bit more agility XP on top of that. We'll be 999 away as it stands. So hopefully this is not too bad. It is a quest that we had to do anyway as well, so we would have been doing it either way. I'm going to save my summer pie until I fail an obstacle. Not that obstacle. Okay, I'm going to just drink this. I have an invent space. Oh, I need to light it. Let's go. Actually, scratch what I just said about holding my summer pies. I'm going to be using them before this rope swing, because this rope swing's a cunt if you get it wrong. So, I'm going to whack the preserve on, chomp down on a summer pie, and pray to Guthics that we don't fail this. Let's go! Okay, this could hurt. Okay, we have the first one. Is that the second one? Never lucky. So it's got to be here. It's not just going to be a straight line, surely. Now I'm going to go up and I'm going to fall. Watch. Fucking hate this game. Please tell me it's not like all the way along the... I don't want to have to fail this more times. Let's go, there we go. Okay, I'm going to mark that last tile so we don't have to ever remember it again. I don't think too much is going to be aggressive to me in here. Oops. Already low on food. I know there's more places you can get it in the dungeon, but not that much. Oh no. 
I did not know how much that was going to hit me for. Okay, at least it wasn't too bad. Ow. Gosh damn. Well, we're meant to have a higher thieving level or something? I don't think I've ever failed this before. That's three times in a row. Four times in a row. This is insane! That's five fails! What's going on? All my food's going on this orb of light! Let's go! You ain't better than me, you little cunty log log. Just keeping my uh, preserve and rapid heal on for the entire time I'm down here, because we've got this altar anyway, so... Another random little tip if you're doing the underground pass is that the traps down here, aside from the 50, this is always 15 over here, this ma like the maze bit, but the rest of the traps down here deal a different amount of damage depending on how low your health is. That the lower your health is, the less damage you take from them. They scale down. So it is better generally to keep your health on the lower end. As weird as that is, you don't want it too low, obviously. But yeah, generally better to keep it on the lower side than be healing up to full. So you take less damage from the traps that you do fill. So yeah, I took three from the last one of those, and I only took two from that one when I filled. Because I was lower. I took two again there. I believe there's some food down here. Right there. Nice. Just gonna top up a tiny bit. Oh no. I felt that bit even. Probably should be a little more careful with my prayer now because we may need it later. For fuck's sake. Okay, I'm gonna turn off rapid. Please. What the fuck, man? I know I'm a low agility level, but I don't remember it ever being this bad. Maybe I've always done it at a higher level. I guess one of the first things you do on most accounts is go run laps till you get graceful, so... It makes sense that I'm usually at a higher level when doing this. I thought with the summer pie boost it wouldn't be that bad though. Finally got past that first one that I've literally never failed before. This is the one that you always fail, so... Uh, low hopes, but I don't know, we're... Making it so far. Okay, past the first sort of choke point there. We just straight... Oh my gosh, I've never done that in one go. It's so weird what you fail and what you don't. I don't think we need our agility again for a little bit, so I'm going to turn the preserve off. I wonder what happens if you try and grind that. Is it just a normal unicorn horn? Or is it a quest item? Can you get another one if you lose it? Right, I'm fairly certain these guys are going to give me some more food. If I just talk to them. I didn't have room, I guess. Nice. So they have served their use. Just make sure there's nothing in the crates and then we'll kill them all. Actually, we've got a range pot. So far, we're not doing too bad. There's a big portion left to go, but I'd say we're probably about halfway through. Just about to get into the main central chamber. So far, so good. Guess I don't need this piece of railing anymore, do I? So far in this dungeon, we've gained three agility experience. What the fuck? How'd you even get a three experience drop? What is this? We're at 38 XP an hour, y'all. It's insane rates. Okay, we got the gauntlets. Isn't there a guy down here who can sell us food, though? Hey, he sold me some food. That's okay. Just want to top up a tiny bit. Wait, we got agility drained? The fuck? I must have... I think I, like, took a drink from the dwarf guy or something. I didn't really mean to. I was just clicking through the conversation, but... Damn, I'm gonna have to double pie. And fail. I don't want to run out of these pies. There's not that many to go, is there? Let's go. Let's go. Four slots. I don't... One, two... No, I don't have enough. There we go. Okay, we gotta restore a super attack. A book and a doll. I don't really need a super attack, so... I'll just drop that. Could I put a range point in there? To be honest, I don't think I really need a restore, but... I'm not sure why they gave me it, so I'm gonna keep it just in case. Oh, I did not mean to pick up the ashes. Uh, we can drop these ropes though, we only needed those for that first 
rope swing. I was worried about filling. Place done. Oh my gosh. It's like the worst place to fall. Okay, can I go from the other way? That, oh, there's no map in here. What am I doing? I might be able to go from the other way. I'm hoping there's a way to get to him that has less bridges. I think there's still going to be a couple in there. Oh, could I kill him and telegrab? I could probably telegrab from here. I could probably just kill him across that to be f Oh no, we need that, don't we? We need to go there. Fuck. Yeah, that's so annoying. Okay, I still think I'm gonna try going this way. No, this is not good. This is not looking good. Oh my. That was like the worst place to fall, honestly. My energy is starting to get low. Only got three stam doses left, no energies. Five solar pies. How much have we got left? I mean, not too much, but depending on how many times we fail, it could be like significantly worse. Okay, we just have to hop this one more. Let's go. Okay. Return to the dwarves. Fuck. I mean, if I fail, then I'm down there. I think you actually want to fail. There we go. Okay, get some dwarven ale. Yeah, we are definitely getting there. The, the main, like, would, we don't have a lot of steps to do, it's just whether we fail obstacles. Okay. Oh, what the fuck? Don't PJ me. As soon as Cataract goes down, they all go nuts on you. Apparently they didn't, though. They're supposed to, like, all start getting super pissy with you as soon as you kill Kaurag, but I don't know why they didn't. That energy is not looking pretty. Okay. We are literally, like, at the end bit. We've got two more hops, I think. <sighs> Please, Gothics, let me through. Thank you. Yeah, can you let me carry on? I'm going to kill the Disciples over here because I want to see if I can get across while I've still got the plus five agility boost because we don't need it anymore. Let's fucking go. All right, we're done with this quest pretty much. Now realizing I didn't bring a Ring of Jeweling. Whoa, those are expensive. Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. I'll have some cash. Why the fuck not? A lot of damage quickly. What are you on about? I've never taken damage in this place. Oh, it's search. That's why. I have no idea what's going on. My client's bugged. Oh, here we go. I feel like I missed a cutscene or something. Back to the entrance. We got our Ibon stuff though now. Wait, why am I walking? We need to go to LMS. We was about 35 minutes, I think. Obviously, I'll show the, the time when I've checked the footage and edit this, but... I think it took us about 35 minutes to do Underground Pass, so that's not that bad, really, for one of the most hated quests in the game at a very low level, you know, 47 agility. Alright, so we need some water runes and some more <laughs> stamina energy, but we are pretty much done now. I just need to go turn this in. That's a Camelot teleport. Why is that a Camelot teleport? Did I not get enough runes? Now we are still going to need about 900 experience after this. So it is looking slim that we'll get the Monkey King free today. Because that is quite... I think there's a fair few steps to that from what I remember. But we need to finish the agility off first. But there is Underground Pass done. We are going to... I guess we'll go to the Grand Exchange. I'm going to get RFD Monkey up while I'm here, just in case there's anything I need to buy for it. Monkey nuts. Okay, we probably have some bird's nests. Yep. Yeah. Oh, shit, did I not start the day out with a birdhouse run? Did I forget to do a birdhouse run at the start of the day? Holy shit! Oh my gosh, y'all, how did you let me not do a birdhouse run? I'm, I'm blaming the internet, because it's not fair to blame me. There's a hammer. There's a chisel, there's a jeweling ring, there's an Ardoon cape, there is a German staff. There is one sad loser who didn't start his day with a birdhouse run. 
got one less from this one, actually. Okay, apparently we need five laps of Canaphis. Shouldn't take too long. Very good birdhouse run. Nine nests. There's a free glory. Don't know why that was there, but I will take it. Okay, I want my Alk star. Do we have a summer pie left as well for the boost so we don't fail at the end? <sighs> I forgot to reset. And I don't have my lava staff, but that's okay. There's one. There's a bank at Canaphis. Okay. Five laps of Canaphis. Here we go. Fuck. <sighs> oh my gosh, I've just failed twice in a row at that last part. I got the mysterious old man. Oh, it's just a present. If it was a maze, I would have probably done it. If I fail again, like, this is just the worst. We've missed, like, two laps of the 150 XP completion bonus. I'm gonna have to party again before. Thank you. 175 completion bonus, even. We, we, we would be done by now if we'd got those laps. Rather than failing at the second to last obstacle. Okay, another one down. One more successful lap. Please. Thank fuck. There is 48 agility. We are teleporting straight to Lumbridge. No time to waste. Only 12 minutes left on the clock. Nice thing about forgetting that birdhouse run though. We don't have to pick it up at the end of the day now. So we have a full 12 minutes here to do as much as we can. Right, how we get into Ape at all, it's probably gonna be PvP Arena, but we need a Gree Gree. We need all the stuff. I'm gonna go bank first. Beautiful. Right, so we're going to Ape at all. That's PvP Arena, plus Glider. Don't know if we can glide straight there or if we have to do this quest first. Oh no, we don't have it. Okay, so we're gonna have to go down through the old fashioned way. I think it might actually be worth just killing the monkeys on the way, or uh, the snakes on the way. Otherwise, I'll have to get some more. Unless we can't get the corpse yet, but I feel like we should be able to. Didn't bring any poison. Oh no, I needed any poison. It's only one at least. Probably gonna kill a couple of these, make sure I get the backups in case I fuck it up. Should really kill like three, because it'll be a pain to come back if I do. At least saw me it drops the course, so I didn't just waste my time killing this. Oh my god, it didn't drop anything. I hate my fucking life. Why am I- oh my god, stop hitting me! Bruh. Let me put the gree gree on. Jesus Christ. That was a horrible experience. No fucking shot, we finished this today. Ah. Hello, your majesty. Okay, now we have to go back to fucking Crash Island. I'm gonna go ahead and just get the red banana while I'm running this way. Okay. Spent the last two minutes flicking these snakes. I'm hoping that I can kill one more before time gets too low. Three would be ideal to, for me to feel safe about. Hopefully not burning. We actually need our boost still as well. I didn't buy it yet. Come on! One more hit! No, one more hit! Oh my gosh. Ah. Uh... I guess we're dying again, y'all. It's a good job I didn't get the scurry back. <laughs> oh, I swear the amount of deaths we've had on this account. Time running out now. It's, it's exactly what I expected when I started the series. Oh my gosh. I mean, I guess it's one way to get a reset. We were going to go to the Ferox Enclave, but this is a free reset. Like, we just start off tomorrow having to speak to death. Hopefully we didn't actually lose anything there. Wow. Well, that's today, folks. We are getting there. We're almost done with the RFD monkey. All we have to do is get the nuts 
special monkey nuts from the agility course, which we should be able to do no problem with our 48 agility. And then we have to go and cook it. So we need to get ourselves a chef's delight as well so we can boost up to 70 and then we go and cook them. We've, we've prepared like three lots in case. Although I might need to get some more bananas to do three lots. But yeah, progress is certainly being made. We've gained far 4,000 agility XP today, 4,600 magic XP overall, just 17k with 3,000 coming in for attack and hunter. But not too much. Mainly it was getting that underground pass done, which is huge. Definitely a big quest to get out of the way and one that we had to do in order for... I can't remember if it's for Legends quest or just for RFD in general. Or I know we had to have it done. It was a mandatory quest on the list. And it gave us five quest points, which is very nice. We're all the way up to 164, I believe. Yeah, 164 now, so very, very close to that 175 goal that is needed for the final portion of RFD. And yeah, count's not looking too bad, y'all. We're certainly getting there. And at least we had some audio today, right? And another death for y'all. I, I swear to it, like, I, just, I keep dying at the end of the session. <laughs> That's exactly what I expected to happen when I started this account. Weirdly, it didn't happen so much in Season 1. I think I was way more careful with the end of sessions in Season 1. Whereas now I'm just like, fuck it, if we run out of time, we run out of time. I've already spent 2 million on Scurrius, who gives a fuck at this point? <laughs> Anyway though, that is going to be all for this one. If you enjoyed the video, please do leave us a like and a comment down below. Hit that subscribe button, all the good stuff, so you see all the future content as it comes. Other than that, look after yourselves, be lovely to one another, and I will see you on the next one.